The FireLock NXT dry valve comes packaged in one box, which reduces project costs and speeds and simplifies out-of-the-box installation. Before installation, always reference the installation instructions included. The Victaulic Quick Riser, or VQR, ships nearly fully trimmed with a drain kit, preset air supervisory and alarm switches, all air and water gauges, and the control valve. Switches and gauges are added after mounting. First, start by installing the VQR with a FireLock EZ009N coupling to the piping below. Before installation, remove all plastic caps and foam spacers from the valve. Tighten down the FireLock EasyStyle 009N by alternating evenly on each side until pad-to-pad -pad contact occurs. Push a Style 009N rigid coupling into the top of valve, then insert the pipe. Correctly tighten the coupling. FireLock NXT Series 768 dry valves should only be installed in the vertical position with the arrow on the body pointing upwards. Install all accessories per the trim drawing located in the included installation instructions. All components are preset for the minimum set point of 13 PSI, 89.6 kPa, 0.89 bar. Take the EPS 45 2V air pressure switch, easily identified by the label on top, and connect it to the air side of trim. Connect the remaining EPS 10-2 water pressure switch and install it onto the alarm line. After both pressure switches have been installed, it is time to mount the air and water gauges. Start by threading the three-way valve into the trim on the upper drain. Install the air pressure gauge here. Then follow the same procedure for the water supply gauge on the lower drain and the diaphragm charge line gauge located above the diaphragm. Next, install the drain extension pipe with drip cup to the lower main drain valve. Compression fittings and tubes are provided for connection from the outlet of the auto drain, actuator, and drip check to the drip cup or drain. The compression fitting for the actuator is a 90 degree elbow configuration. Once complete, Insert all the tube ends through the hole in the orange cap of the drip cup. Mount the Series 7C7 compressor to the pipe above. Then connect the supplied braided hose from the compressor to the air manifold. If required, attach the Series 746 Low Pressure Accelerator, or LPA, to the air manifold with the vent seal button installed facing down toward the trim. Note that when using an accelerator, the system air supply must be fed from a tank-style unit and air be regulated by a Series 757 air maintenance trim device. Finally, connect the drainage pipe to the required location. This video is not a substitute for thorough reading and understanding of the latest public FireLock NXT Dry Valve Series 768 Operating Maintenance and Testing Manual or the installation instructions. For more information, contact Victaulic.